Today's Make It Enterprising Challenge has been sponsored by Siemens at Congleton and we've had 12 teams from schools across Cheshire competing today. Um, the event has gone very well. The teams have been set tasks around creating new products and services for one of a choice of customers, including an airport, a theme park, a, a food manufacturing business. So they've had to decide the job roles that they're going to take on the day, they've had to come up with new product development ideas, they've had to cost the materials, they've had to build something, uh, and they're just about to pitch their ideas to our dragons. So we're really excited to hear what ideas they've come up with today. Our company's called Effective and we want our products, that's why we're called our company Effective because we want our, our products to be effective. Um, today we're designing a roller coaster theme park and um, in the theme park we're going to um, do all sorts of technology and we're going to um, do a food area and a ticket booth and design different things for our theme park. Um, we want our, our team to win because um, we're that very, very determined and um, um, very um, creative and um, very focused. Well, the uh, future of any uh, country, community or indeed um, company is reliant on young people and it's absolutely fantastic to see all these young people here learning about uh, British manufacturing and the opportunities that they will get for the future when they make their decisions to what sort of professions and occupations they want to go and what manufacturing has to offer for uh, the young people of this country. The team is really delighted to be involved in this initiative. Uh, when the Manufacturing Institute approached us for this, we were very quick to take the opportunity. From our perspective, the reason we're involved in this is to get young people excited about manufacturing, to get them to understand that manufacturing and engineering is really relevant. And we're doing that for a number of reasons. The main reason, I would say, is that in five to ten years' time, we realise that in this country, Siemens and other organisations are going to have a shortage of engineers and people in manufacturing. So we need to get this generation excited, we need to get this generation thinking now that careers in manufacturing and engineering are the choice for them. So that's our main reason for being involved, is to get young people excited about engineering and manufacturing and hopefully one day become employees of Siemens, if not Siemens, some other engineering and manufacturing companies. And when, we, when I first came here I thought manufacturing was just, um, just about money and, and electricity and stuff but now I come here it's about travelling the world and they're well paid for it and, and about engineering and stuff.